In the light of the moon, a small egg lay on a leaf. One Sunday morning, the warm sun came up and, pop! Out of the egg came the tiny and very hungry caterpillar. This hungry caterpillar sported a brilliant, translucent green body punctuated with a series of distinctively patterned yellow, black, and purple spots outlining each of its tiny segments. At one end of the caterpillar's elongated body, a pair of charming, big eyes took prominence above a generously curved mouth. Upon entering the world, the hungry caterpillar began an immediate search for food. The first day, the hungry caterpillar found and ate through a ripe red apple. The simplicity and bright redness of the apple contrasted sharply with the delicate green of the hungry caterpillar's body. As days passed, the hungry caterpillar's appetite grew. On the following days, the hungry caterpillar devoured a series of foods, two pears on Monday, three plums on Tuesday, four strawberries on Wednesday, and five oranges on Thursday. The array of colors from the fruits, the soothing green of the pears, the deep violet of the plums, the vibrant red of the strawberries, and the bright orange of the oranges, created a mosaic of growing consumption. On Friday, driven by an insatiable hunger, the hungry caterpillar did not stop at fruits. The hungry caterpillar moved on to indulge in a spectacular feast, chocolate cake, ice cream, a pickle, Swiss cheese, salami, a lollipop, a piece of cherry pie, a sausage, a cupcake, and watermelon. Each item introduced an explosion of textures and hues, creamy browns and whites of the cake and ice cream, the deep greens of the pickle, the creamy yellows with holes of the Swiss cheese, the pink and white of the salami, the shiny red and white of the lollipop, the vibrant red filling and flaky golden crust of the cherry pie, the rich brown of the sausage, the fluffy light brown of the cupcake, and the lush red and green of the watermelon slice. That night, a noticeable change overcame the hungry caterpillar. The hungry caterpillar felt a distinct stomachache after such an indiscriminate feast. The following day, the hungry caterpillar, now more cautious, returned to a more modest meal, nibbling through a nice green leaf. This leaf brought the circle of diet back to the simplicity and freshness where it began, restoring the bright green vibrancy to the hungry caterpillar's skin. After this journey through foods and colors, growth enveloped the hungry caterpillar. No longer tiny, the hungry caterpillar was now a big, fat caterpillar. The hungry caterpillar then built a small house, called a cocoon, around itself. Enclosed in this cocoon, Resting on a bright leaf under the sun, the hungry caterpillar stayed inside for more than two weeks. Then, the caterpillar nibbled a hole in the cocoon, pushed its way out, and out emerged a beautiful butterfly. The wings of the new butterfly displayed a breathtaking mix of brilliant colors and intricate patterns, featuring shades of vibrant blues, stunning yellows, and deep blacks, forming an artist's palette. This transformation marked the end of an epic journey of growth, vivid colors, hunger, and change.